Huh. Oh hey, didn't see you there. Sup gamer, today I got a tutorial for ya on how you can become Female Rivers Cuomo from Weezer. And yeah, we're only sitting on the floor for this one. Like cool kids. Coming in hot with step number one is our preparation. We gotta prep up our skin, bros. I got baby powder for this one. Because I'm a baby, and so are you. Now you just gotta spread that all over your face. Oh wow, nice one. You made it past step one. How'd you do that? Now that our skin's all prepped up, next thing we gotta do is the base eyeshadow thing. So we're gonna be using Weezer Blue for this one, guys, before we add in the darker shades. We're gonna try out something real quick, cool guy. Let's apply some of that eyeshadow using this funky brush thing. Huh. Amazing. It seems like nothing's changed. I think we gotta get our awesome drip bangs out of the way, home slice. Huh. Out of sight, out of mind. Now we apply our eyeshadow thing using our fingertips instead. Just trust me on the process, man. Oh wow, see that big difference? You're looking very Weezer already. Hell yeah. Now it's time to pick up a darker shade. And I mean, the living in LA kind of stuff. Haha. <laughs> Black Album, am I right? Oh Weezer, so silly. Now would you look at that, already making big difference. <laughs> look at all that progress! Now it only gets better from here, dog. Hope you're still with me, stick around some more for the next tips. But before we move on, I'm just gonna need a tiny amount of tissue to dab on the excess makeup and all. Next, we do our eyeliner. They always say that if you're good at something, you do it with your eyes closed. But in this case of applying eyeliner, only the coolest of professionals can do it with their eyes open. Watch and learn, son. It's looking good so far. We always gotta double check if our eyeliner's even, but experts like me already know I got this. Next we're gonna be doing a little hack here, since I'm speedrunning this and skipping the mascara and falsies. We're gonna deepen the look by drawing the lower eyelashes. Now normally, I would recommend using a brown colored eyeliner for a more cute and natural look, but it looks like we're gonna work with what we got right now. Now, since we used a black eyeliner for that one, we're gonna have to blend it with a bit of some more of that black eyeshadow. But remember kids, we don't want to overdo that. You're gonna end up smudging all that hard work. Oh wow, looking good, looking good. Looks like we're all set for our female Rivers Cuomo eye look. Just a few more steps till we reach the final look. Hang in there, bruh. For this one, I'll be applying some lip balm first to prep up. I live in tropical country, so my lips are always dry, and I hate it here. Next, we gotta add in some color with a little bit of liquid lipstick. I prefer to use matte so it doesn't have too much of that oily and glossy feel. Oh no, what am I doing? Oh no, ah! Haha, <laughs> just kidding. I'm not eating that tissue. I'm using it once again to remove a bit of that excess makeup. <laughs> not bad, cool cat. Seems like that's our final makeup look. Now, we're gonna need our wig. First, we're gonna need our wig cap. I think some of you can skip this part, but as you can see, I've got very fluffy and thick and cute hair. To tell you the truth, I have no idea on what I'm doing. But I think we can just go with the flow and trust the process once again on this one, man. 
Here's the wig I'm using. I won't have a bob cut one at the moment, but we work with what we got. One thing I learned is that it's helpful to set the wig inside out before wearing it so it looks nicer. I have no idea if what I'm doing here is right. But I'm the one making this tutorial, so everything I do here is pretty much legit. At this point, you're gonna want to feel if the wig feels right in your head. Also, I'm not gonna set the clips on for this one, because the wig's not gonna fall off. Not on my watch, yo. I usually buy cheap wigs, because I prefer to spend my money on better things, like Weezer... Fortnite. And you can see that my wig here is a bit thin. And I also gotta mention it before I get any haters calling me out of the comment section. But I store my wigs by braiding them because since they're kinda cheap, I can't use any products to detangle them. And they kinda just straighten out by themselves anyway. You'll see what I mean. Wow, looking good once again. Now you can see that the fringes here would have been the length of the wig that we need for a more accurate female rivers look. But we can't always have what we want in the world. You know what I'm saying? Alright, we're done with the look. And now we prepare our fit real quick. Hold on, gang. I'm missing something. Wow. Nice. Now that we got the female rivers look ready, we can 